So in this video, I'm going to be showing you the power, the real power of um, risk reward and really going for more than you risk, right? And really just understanding, I know in the last video I spoke about it, but the fact that you don't really have to have a high win rate. In fact, if you're going for a two to one, um, you really have to have about a 33, 34 percent win rate um, in order for you to just break even, so you not to lose continually lose money, right? So um, this is a piece of software, it's a video um, where you're pretty much just heads, tails, um, where you have you know, 200, 100, basically just a two to one reward risk ratio with a probability um, win rate of 40%. So we're gonna you know, classify heads as our, as our wins, right? And um, this is just to show you um, really the power of um, risk reward in conjunction with you know the law of large numbers and really having a larger sample size in order to work with um uh rather than you know a lot of traders system hop but simply because they uh don't understand that you need you know not just 10 trades or 20 trades you probably need you know 100 500 to a thousand to really know where you are in um when it comes to uh, your, your your profitability, for example, right? And whether you are actually making money, right? So first of all, you've got to think to yourself, can I be right 40% of the time, right? Am I going to lose 60% of the time, right? So just kind of, you know, lowball your expectations to a certain extent. Of course, you know, we, we, we want to be right, you know, 50, 55, 60% of the time, right? But let's just say worst case scenario, you know, we're, we're looking at, you know, 40 to, you know, maybe the, the, the high 30s, right? But we're always going for at least a minimum of a two to one, right? Now, I'm not going to go through the whole video, but we're going to go through um, some of the video where, you know, we get to, you know, we start to visualize you know where we are right speed it up a little bit right now let's pause so you can see imagine for example we uh you didn't see let's say for example here right let's say the rest of this chart didn't exist right and we only had you know we, we, we've taken 40 trades right actually let's go through this so you take the first, you know, few trades and, um, you know, you're taking about eight, nine trades, eight trades and um, everything's looking great, right? Everything's looking fantastic. So this hasn't happened yet, right? Everything's looking brilliant. You're happy. And then all of a sudden you're still taking trades and now you're back down, right? So this is your new high, right? This is where your equity, new equity high is. And now, you know, 15, 20 trades later, you're back down to, you know, here, right? In your profit and loss account. You start going through a sideways range. Most traders um, will actually uh, probably system hop. They will go to another system and look uh, for um, something that's going to take them, you know, pretty much, you know, like this, and it's normal. But you have to understand that you're in a probabilities game, right? Even if you're winning at a fifty or sixty percent win ratio, you know, the market, your your equity curve is never going to move up one hundred percent, right? You will have losing streaks. You will have losing trades. You may have a losing streak of maybe five, six, seven, eight trades, right? It's just the way that the numbers distribute, right? So you can also see that for, you know, at least, you know, 44, 45 trades, right? Imagine again, this didn't exist to the to the right of that. Um, you didn't make a new equity high. If you're one of these traders that can get through this and continue, you know, to trade, follow the process, right? And continue to go for your risk reward, eventually you will make new equity highs, right? But again, a lot of traders cannot stomach and they can't stand and they don't understand the fact that you can have sideways ranging markets for a while. And this, this may represent, you know, uh, three weeks, three months, you know, six months worth of trading, right? 
you know, these these trades here, depending on how many trades, you know, a week or a month you, you take, right? You, you might not necessarily make um, any money, you, you know, you're breaking even, you're seeing your profit and loss go higher and lower, right? But we have all these trades yet to take, right? And again, I, it's it's very easy to, to, to jump ship after 20 trades and say, okay, well, it doesn't work. Your system doesn't work, right? But um, on, and this is not just me, this is for whoever, right? This is whoever, this is just trading in general, right? It's up to you to see out the numbers, see how the numbers play out and keep taking the processes because eventually you will start to make new equity highs, right? You will even have drawdowns, right? So you'll have new equity high and then you'll get this move here, right? And you'll have a drawdown, right? Drawdowns are normal when it comes to um, you know new equity highs and lows right nothing moves in a straight line um, so um, just continue continue to trade right the best that you can taking a you know a two to one minimum and eventually let the numbers play out right as they do and you can see that we get obviously new highs now let's just continue on a little bit and uh, let's see, there's a bit in here, right? So let's say, let's say for example, we are here, right? Let's say we're here, and this hasn't, uh, you know, occurred yet to the right of the chart. Now, you may join, you know, this, and you're watching this, obviously. And we don't know, obviously, when we're going to get the drawdowns. We have no idea. Now, you may have joined. Um, you've you've missed out on this brilliant move here, you know, to, uh, um, you know, make some gains in your account. You've just joined. Um, and now you're joining in a drawdown. Now, this, <laughs> you know, the, uh, the left side of the chart, you know, you weren't here for. Right. You've just joined right here and all you're seeing is a drawdown again does this mean that the system doesn't work absolutely not you're not aware of you know what's about to come into the future when you uh when you're trading at two to ones and again this could last for a period of time right i understand that we all want you know instant results we all do and i want the best for you. I want you to see the power of you know um, you know the fact that you can be successful in forex trading, right? If you just follow the process and understand um, you know um, the law of large numbers and, and risk rewards, right? As well as your own you know psychology, because psychology does come into this as well. You know, um, losing how you feel, etc. Right? Now, are you tough enough? Are you have you got the mental fortitude? to see this drawdown and go through this drawdown instantly, right? Most traders probably won't, right? And I know I'm gonna lose a few traders when they join um, in, in periods like this, right? But what you will also miss out on is you're gonna miss out on the new equity highs, right? You're gonna miss out on all of this move, right? So. Just understand that, you know, um, and it's not just me, you know, any uh, educating, you know, educator or, or trading system that you do decide to um, try out and take on and buy um, is not going to be perfect. You may join in a drawdown. You may join, uh, unfortunately, the worst case scenario, you might join somewhere here, you know, where the next maybe, you know, 10, 15 trades are, aren't, you know, great. Right, and remember, this is with a forty percent win rate. Right, this is just to illustrate that these drawdowns can happen even in a 50 60 percent win rate. Right, but this is why win rate isn't important if you've got the risk reward on your side. It's just really about understanding again, the law of large numbers, giving something time, right, giving it time to work out and really just going through the process of trading don't um you know start to add things don't start to remix anything just take the trades follow the rules um go for more than you risk etc and eventually 
this is what will happen. We will have drawdowns along the way. You will have drawdowns along the way for you know for a certain period of time. But the more you trade, and this you know is pretty representative of potentially years. This is what happens. This is what managing money, and your own money, is all about. Right, so we have a big enough sample size now, you know, 20, 15,000 trades, right? However long that takes, this is exactly what your equity curve will look like. So I also want to uh, bring in a, another video and look at um, this. And I'll get rid of that one. To the side. So this is a video on, and it's basically pretty much the same video, right? Heads, tails, with a 35% win rate, right? And 35% win rate, obviously we need at least 33% just to break even. So this is just above, you know, your, uh, your, your, uh, your break even rate, right? And again, let's start to, you know, visualize, right? And you can see that obviously over six, seven, eight, eight hundred trades, you could, you know, pretty much going straight down into a drawdown. Yeah. Thousand trades. This isn't, you know, pretty, this isn't sexy or anything like that, right? It's it's it would be very, very difficult for any trader to um, continue uh, trading a system after three hundred trades and you find yourself, you know, two hundred trades and trade and you find yourself down here, right? Um so, you know, but eventually what you get is you start to get new equity highs, right? And I think we do get another drawdown, an even worse drawdown, right? Yeah, we go below as we start to go, you know, down here. But as we forward, right? And this is again, just a demonstration. I'm not saying that you should go through all this and stick with a system. Um, you know, after 10,000 trades, I doubt anybody would get to 10,000 trades, you know, trading at 35% or two to one, right? And find themselves and say, okay, this is definitely working, right? But this is just to demonstrate the power, right, of eventual risk reward, even if you've just got, you know, a 2% probability higher, right? A 2% edge higher than, um, than the uh, than the risk reward ratio. Eventually, you will make money. You will make a profit. So um, I do hope that helps. Always keep this in mind. You know, play this video back. Um, and uh, if you do want the video, um, I'll be happy to uh, give it to you. Just uh, send me an, um, an email at info at trading one eighty dot com, right? And I'll be happy to uh, give you this video, and it will just remind you of um you know just to go for more than you risk you may enter into drawdowns don't worry about it just keep going um you know for two to ones three to ones four to ones and the three to one ratio again is i think you need 25 percent win rate to, to to break even can you get more than a 25 but can you win more than 25 percent of the time you know, 26, 27% of the time, 28% of the time, 30% of the time at a three to one risk reward ratio. So um don't take profits too early. If you lose a few trades, don't worry about it. If you know trades go up to your, uh, you know, just before your uh, take profit, but then reverse and stop you out. You know, there's always ways of uh, managing risk. You can move your stop to break even, etc., and protect yourself. Um, but don't get negged out. Don't get. Don't feel down when you know you you lose certain trades. Just understand that eventually, right? You will see your. Um, your 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 profits um, increase over time.